Here is another Zapdos pack. Get some ASMR going right here. That is satisfying. Okay, so let's cut this open. Today we're gonna take a trip down memory lane. We're going back to 1999 to do something really hype, something really great. We will be opening a Pokemon Fossil Booster Pack. This pack right here is 21 years old. I'm 24, it's almost as old as me. And in today's video, we're not just gonna open one, we're gonna open four, and as you see in the background, I have a lot more packs. How you guys doing? My name is Vinny, I also go by the name Original151, and I am currently addicted to Pokemon card collecting. If you are new here, hit that subscribe button, ring the bell so you can stay up to date whenever I post these brand new TCG videos. And guys, today is a big one, Vintage Packs, the Fossil Set, one of my favorite sets. We're opening four of these today, we're going for the Hollow Dragonite, hopefully we could get a Hollow Bird, anything Hollow, honestly, I'll be happy. This is just going to be awesome. Now, another thing. I brought my sleeves today. Gotta make sure you come prepared to protect the cards. I also brought a scissor. And you might be thinking, Vinny, you look like a strong guy. We know you work out. You can't open these with your bare hands. And to answer that question, no, I clearly can't. I'm gonna link a video down below. We opened up a vintage Team Rocket Unlimited Booster Pack in the last episode that we did, in the last TCG video that we did. And I couldn't get the thing open. It took me a very long time. So today we are just going to cut these packs from the top, pull the cards out, and we are going to keep it moving. But before we open these, I want to appreciate these, okay? They're 21 years old. I have to make sure that I emphasize that. They're in mint condition. They are beautiful. They are nostalgic. Here's the Zapdos pack. We also have an Aerodactyl pack. Oh, Aerodactyl. I love the early designs. They just... That original art, you just can't beat it, ladies and gentlemen. Also, this is the first TCG video I'm filming on my brand new iPhone uh, 12 Pro. So let me know if you can see a difference in quality. I mean, the last iPhone recorded amazing quality and this just looks even better. So that's great. All right, ladies and gentlemen, it's gonna be a short video. It's gonna be a sweet video. Let's not waste any time. Let's grab this Zapdos pack first. We have two of these that we're opening up today and let's just take our scissors. Gotta love that very satisfying sound. Let's cut the top. Yo, I'm so excited, man. I'm freaking out. Okay, okay. I can do this. Just breathe in. Breathe out. We premiere these videos. Make sure you get some hype up in the chat. Members, I want to see some Pog emotes. And there we go. The first pack has been cut open. Let's slide these out. Oh my goodness ladies and gentlemen 21 year old cards i actually really like the cutting method that is that is really nice as opposed to just like ruffling your fingers trying to get these open all right so let's just look oh my god do they have that new card smell even though they're 21 years old Woo! they smell great okay let's do the card trick so one two three now this card in the back is going to be our rare our potential hollow the borders look great Let's flip it around and let's begin. Oh, baby, look at that. So we are starting off with a Tentacruel. The nostalgia is so real right now. I literally remember this specific card. I definitely have this locked away in a drawer or a closet somewhere. I absolutely love this Tentacruel. Oh, we have a Golem. Dude, I remember this like it was yesterday. This is crazy. Really got to appreciate that old art. That is absolutely, absolutely gorgeous. One of my favorite cards in, in TCG history. We have a wheezing. Dude, dude, this is, this is taking me back. Is this taking you guys back? Because it's definitely taking me back. By the way, the borders, everything about these cards looks perfect. Next up, we have a gambler card. I'm not gonna lie, I'm very excited about this, but you know, gambler card specifically, not very excited about that. It's kind of whatever. We have a Geodude. This card is really, I feel like this card is just famous. Everybody knows this Geodude card. We have an Ekans. It's so crazy how they still, after 21 years, are just super duper pristine. They just, shout out to super duper Danny, by the way. Every time I say the phrase super duper, I immediately think of super duper Danny. Here we have an energy search. A Tentacool, so we got a Tentacool and a Tentacruel. We have a couple cards left. Another trainer card, so a lot of trainer cards in this first pack right here. Recycle. <gasps> a Hollow Magneton! I thought we had one more card! 
Ladies and gentlemen, we already pulled a holographic card from this fossil pack. Give me a sleeve right now. Oh my god. Oh my god. I am literally... Dude. Dude, I'm freaking out. That is a hollow magneton. Let's put that directly into the sleeve. Oh, baby. Oh, I'm so happy we pulled a hollow. I'm so happy we pulled a hollow. That is gorgeous. Now, you guys, again, I'm learning. You gotta let me know. Is this a very rare card? Is it valuable? You guys have to tell me. As far as the condition of this card, I mean, it is, it is mint. The borders look great. There might be, is that on the, yeah, no, that's just on the sleeve. I was gonna say, there might be a little nick towards the top, but no, that looks great. Let's flip it around. Dude, this, I really do believe this will get a 10. The top border is a little bit more thick than the bottom border. But other than that, we, we might be looking at a potential PSA 10 holographic magneton from Fossil Set. Oh, my goodness, is that gorgeous. Look at that. All right, so we are going to put that to the side for now. That is just, let me move that away from the scissor a little bit. That is just absolutely, actually, let's put it over here so you guys can see it in the background. That is gorgeous. Let me take the rest of the cards over here and put them over there. Okay, so already we pulled a hollow. We are off to a fantastic start. Let's now go with the, let's go with the Aerodactyl, okay? He, after all, he is a fossil Pokemon. Let's see if we can get another holographic card. <laughs> Dude, this is so exciting, man. I, I love doing this. You guys know I've been talking about this nonstop. Th these TCG videos are just making me so happy. And you guys are really enjoying these videos as well, which just makes me even happier. Uh, so thank you guys for all your support on these. And welcome to all the new subscribers because the channel has been growing uh, very, very rapidly lately. And that just makes me so happy. Dude, these cards just feel amazing. I know I sound like a broken record, but they really do just feel so great. Okay, so we are going to start off this next pack with a Golbat. Love that art. Cloyster. Now, this is another card that really brings back a lot of memories. I definitely had one of these Cloysters growing up for sure. And again, the borders look great. Maybe a little bit thicker on the right side than the left, but this is, this is fantastic. Here we have a Slowbro. Such a great Pokemon. I love that we just recently got the Galarian Slowbro, which, by the way, if you guys have any Galarian Slowbro cards and you want to send them my way, if you want to send me any Pokemon cards, by the way, the address to my P.O. Box is down below in the description, and I will definitely make more uh, videos from the cards that you guys sent me to the P.O. Box. Here we have a horsey who's just inking up the ocean. Smoke screen, smoke screening up the ocean. That is really, that is just gorgeous right there. I love how this camera can really pick up the intricate details of every card. And I really do love to appreciate every card. Like the trainer card sometimes, for example, the trainer card right here, Gambler, they get a little bit, you know, you're not that excited about them, but they're still great. Any of these cards are still uh, absolutely fantastic. Here we have a trainer card, another trainer card, Recycle. A Krabby. Cookie, cookie. You love to see the homie Krabby just chilling on the beach. I would love to be chilling on a beach right now, but it's approaching winter time and it's getting very, very cold here in New York where I live. Shout out to Shrong Island. Here we have a Shelder. So we got the Slowbro, we got a Shelder. Now I know Shelder doesn't evolve into Slowbro, but in the anime, Slowbro will put his tail, or Slowpoke will put his tail in the water. Shelder will bite it and then they'll morph into Slowbro, which I always found that very, very fascinating. That really is a really cool thing that they did uh, in the anime. Here we have another Ekans card. We have a Mysterious Fossil. How many cards do we have left? We have, I believe, two left. Okay. So next up we have a Muck. Actually, no! That is the rare. Okay, so a rare Muck, not a holographic. That, I've actually, I don't think I've ever seen this card before. That is really, really beautiful. Pokemon Power, Toxic Gas, a little bit thicker on the left border. Other, honestly, other than the border problems, these cards have no damages to them whatsoever. Maybe a little bit of a nick right there, if you guys can see that. It's very, very faint, though. But wow, beautiful card. Again, not a hollow, but I will sleeve this because it is the rare. It is a rare in this set, so let me just put that into the sleeve. So glad I have sleeves in today's video. Oh, that's just that's just great. Again, let's show off the Magneton. And we still have two packs to go, ladies and gentlemen. 
So we got a Muck so far, and we got a Magneton. Beautiful. All right, let me take these. Put them off to the side. Also, let me know, do you guys like these shorter videos? Do you prefer the longer videos? You guys gotta fill me in. Okay, here is another Zapdos pack. Get some ASMR going right here. That is satisfying. Okay, so let's cut this open. I definitely prefer the scissor method. I don't know how many times I gotta say it. This is just, this is so much better. And I feel like it just makes, it keeps the packs better as well, too. You don't rip the packs off, just the top of them get... Uh, rip. Did I not cut the top there? I didn't cut through the entire thing. Can I just rip that with my finger now? Let's see. Look at that. Look at that. Okay, let's slide these out. Very nice. Grab those. Beautiful. They slip off like a glove. Okay. Oh, dude, I just... I'm sorry if I'm going slow. I, I know a lot of you guys appreciate me going slow and appreciating these cards, but I feel like a lot of new people might want me to pick up the pace a little bit. I just, I can't help it. I need to just appreciate the fact that I'm holding these old cards and that it's really taking me back to my childhood. Here we have another Golbat. An Arbok! Charbok! I love that art. That is something else right there. Look how menacing that Arbok looks. Beautiful card. We have a Ghastly. That's a very, very... I actually prefer this Ghastly art to the base set art. This Ghastly is, is gorgeous. I love that. Psyduck, Psyai, shout out to Ethan Dobbs. He's got the Headache Power and Fury Swipes. Ten times attack, you love to see it. Or ten times... I'm not really sure if it's ten times attack. I don't know what the 10X stands for. If you guys didn't know this about me, I actually don't even know how to play the TCG. I just love to collect the cards. So you guys can fill me in what the 10X means. Here we have another Slowpoke. Another Geodude. Another Horsey. So a bunch of duplicates. Trainer. I think we've pulled this in every pack so far, actually. Mysterious Fossil. I think there's one more card after this. And finally... Ammonite? Is there one more? There is one more! There is one more! Dude, I need to learn how many cards are in this set or in these packs. And I have to count properly. Ammonite. Love that. And as you see, he comes from a fossil. And finally... We have a regular rare Haunter. Look at that, dude. So not a hollow. Listen, if we only pulled the one hollow, I will be satisfied for this first video. Like I said, we have more packs in the background. We have plenty, plenty potential. Plenty more potential to pull a hollow in upcoming videos. But look at that. That is beautiful. Again, I will sleeve this up. Let me flip the sleeve around. Slide that in. There we go. Beautiful. The borders on this one actually look pretty good. Let's check out the back. Yeah, it looks it looks really solid. Very, very nice. That is a gorgeous design, too. I, I love... I don't know how many times I gotta say it. The early designs. All right, ladies and gentlemen. Final pack of the day. We have the Lapras pack. Let's hope that we can get a hollow in here. Let's take the scissors. And let's do this, baby. By the way, if you watch my other content on the channel, I am not normally this quiet. I am really just trying to appreciate this right now and not talk so much. I just kind of live in the moment and enjoy what is going on in this video. Okay, card trick is three, of course. One, two, three. Okay, here we go. Last pack, and we are starting off with a Cedra. I remember, dude, I remember this card very vividly. We have a Graveler, so different cards already in this pack. I remember this Graveler as well. A Golduck, another card that we haven't gotten yet. We got the Psyduck now, we got the Golduck. I love how he's just chipping away at that ice, that's that's gorgeous. Okay, Slowpoke, we do have this one already. Beautiful Slowpoke card. Mysterious Fossil, yet again. Ammonite, just pulled him in the last pack. Grimer just chilling by the trash. Look at my mans over here. He's just vibing, dude. Horsey, again, with the smoke screen. Just love these so much. I really do. Zubat. How many do we have left? I want to make sure I count properly. Okay. We should have... I think it goes trainer, then one more card, then the rare. I think. I could be wrong, though. Let's see. A holographic Lapras from the Lapras pack. Dude, look at this. Oh my.
my goodness. Now, just looking at the hollow, it looks pristine. It looks perfect to me, ladies and gentlemen. The borders are slightly thicker, I think, from top to bottom. But other than that, that is a gorgeous hollow. Let's check out the back. Top looks a little bit thicker than the bottom. No nicks, no scratches. This might get a 10, guys. This might get a 10. I will probably get this graded. That is absolutely... I love his mouth. I love the design of this Lapras. That is just amazing. All right, let me grab a sleeve ASAP. Really? Guys, two pulls from four packs. I, I am very happy with that. I am very, very happy with that. Look at that. Okay. Beautiful. So let's just go over the really good cards that we pulled from these four packs. We have a Haunter... Of course, this is probably my favorite card that we pulled. The Hollow Magneton. That's just unbelievable. Sonic Boom, Self-Destruct. We have the Muck, of course, a regular rare. And then we have the Hollow Lapras. So look at that. The two Hollows. Let's hold those up right here. Show you guys what we're working with. Ladies and gentlemen, very successful video. I hope you guys enjoyed this. If you did, make sure you subscribe. Also, before we wrap up, just to show you guys the packs one more time, definitely, again, the scissor. The scissor is definitely uh, the wave. Hit that subscribe button. Hit the like button if you guys enjoyed this video. Thank you so much. Also, shout out to Aman Tastic. I will link your Instagram down below. I bought these packs from Aman. He also sent the rocket pack that we opened up in the previous video that, again, I will link down below. Thank you guys for everything. I love you guys. You are amazing. And have a great rest of your day. Thank you so much for watching. Peace.